Lowrider ST in gunship gray, and I installed, just finishing sand, like 45 to 45 miles per hour wind. So there's absolutely no. It's over here, right, right near my thumb. I found a generic. If I ever get back home. 80 and there's absolutely no hey guys welcome back this video has a lot of per a lot of things that i want to pass uh an update i want to talk about the windshield the uh, the short windshield by harley davidson and i didn't know how to how to wrap this video so i'll just give you a little intro what's going on it's americade bike week i was hoping to get there but I don't know if you, I've told you or not, in two, three weeks, uh, I'm moving to a new place. So, you know, we're in the middle of packing and stuff like that. I don't think I'll be able to get uh, get over to um, Americade and uh, Laconia. Just got back from a flight. Take a look, some nice footage from, uh, you know, from the flight itself. So that's cool. And on that flight, I actually brought with me Sean came to visit, and it's fun. We went, we went for a little ride on the, the first time she's riding the Himal the Himalayan, the Royal Enfield Himalayan, and she really loved it. Take a look. We had a ride, but while we're doing that ride, I said it's a good chance, good opportunity to review the short windscreen, the windshield that I got from Harley Davidson. It's a good opportunity. I took Sean out for a ride. Went. Uh, nearby went also highway speeds to see you know if there's any good protection if there's you know what it looks like and stuff like that so hey i'm sandy and you're watching holy shift this is my new 2022 lowrider st in gunship gray and i installed just finished installing this beautiful tour pack from advan black today i'm gonna actually checking out the low windshield windscreen by harley davidson i think it's called a two inch silk it comes in bronze, the same color as the rims and the accent uh, colors on this beautiful bike. This is Sean over there. My daughter came to visit us. She's going to be riding on the Royal Enfield Himalayan. She's uh, practicing her riding skills a little bit because we're going to be traveling to Vietnam in a few months and go on a nice trek together over there, like riding. So she's with me. She came for a visit. Gonna go to the highway, check the windscreen on uh, highway speed, see if besides being so cool, if it actually gives you some wind protection and how much wind, pro wind protection. So guys, Sean is a new rider. Sure, like she has her license and everything, but she hasn't been uh, riding too much. So we're gonna go slow. And when I need to hit the uh, highway speeds, I'm just gonna tell her to wait on the side of the road for a second. Okay, here she comes. So if you don't know, Harley Davidson sent me this, this short windscreen, a two inch windscreen. It's very, very cool, extremely cool, because it has this beautiful silk color to it. You know, the same, the bronze color, the same color as the, the rims and some of the accents. 
So it's really a cool, a cool looking uh, windshield. So I took the full face helmet in this case, just, you know, to see how much, cause actually I need, I need to be able to record sound and I have the camera, let me show you. See, I have the camera on my helmet. So that's uh, why I put the full face, but I'll open up, I'll open up the uh, visor, the wind, the wind visor to see how much air is hitting me, like how much wind is hitting me in my face. Currently, I can obviously tell you there's tons of wind, of course, because I'm going slow speed and there's zero wind protection. It's literally lower. It's the same height as, uh, as the handlebar, so there is absolutely no wind protection. She goes. Nice. I'm at uh, what are we? 30, 35, zero protection. I didn't expect. Listen, at slower speeds, obviously there's going to be no wind protection. The only question is. At higher speeds, will the you know the shape of the fairing and the windscreen together be able to deflect the wind above my head? I doubt it because I have the stock one. The stock I think is like a four inch, four inch rise, and that is uh, at I think at 40 already. There's uh, there's wind on my face, so let's give it a chance anyway. I'm Why? It's old. Oh, okay. Are you at first now? Go. Uh, stay close to me. Good for her. Well, we're going 34 and there's wind on my face. I'll be with the visor, with the wind, like the, the helmet visor slightly open. I'm giving it a fair, a fair try. I didn't think there, truthfully, I didn't believe there would be any wind protection because, you know, <laughs> physics, it's just a, a short, it's just a short uh, windshield. But we'll give it a fair, a fair chance, a fair, Try anyway, no matter what. Good, good job, girl. She's wearing my Harley jacket. Okay, can the uh, the flat-out bar can it serve as a highway peg? absolutely not you can see it's actually more difficult to get my feet up there well uh, where is she remember a few videos ago i was having trouble when i just started with the the radio uh test with the audio system test and i was complaining that i always have to go to my phone well i found the perfect remote it's over here right right near my thumb i found a generic wait let me lower it i found a generic player i mean a generic remote on amazon there's going to be a link down by the descript description i mounted it over here and it's perfect rockford fosgate actually do make do make their own remote that's a remote that mainly was actually designed for, to be on a steering wheel uh, it has an option to be mounted on a handlebar with straps i saw some pictures some videos that people did of it it looks kind of ridiculous and i think they want 120 dollars i'm not sure pretty pricey and it doesn't uh, mount nicely 
this has a very simple design i think it was like 25 or 29 dollars and it has a battery that lasts for years and look how it mounts nicely and pretty much all the functions i need volume up volume down and pl and play and skip so now let's go to the highway and see how this windshield performs currently obviously the music this 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 stereo system is amazing i mean obviously i'm going 30 but it's so strong so so perfect really they did a re very good job with this mute one finger or thumb didn't move my hand from the steering wheel from the, the handlebar let me lower the volume a little bit so you can actually hear me okay now we're going 45 i'll open up the visor and there's wind in my face like you cannot believe well like you can like 45 to 45 miles per hour wind so there's absolutely no protection at this speed and we'll take it to the highway see if there's any difference i doubt it but i'm closing the visor again let me stop this light i'll take it up to uh 70 80 and then we'll see Okay, we're at 50, and there's there's wind in my face. Wow, the camera just changed. It's 70, 80, and there's absolutely no wind protection. I, I truthfully, I didn't think so. Let me open up the visor, you'll see. Yeah. It's pretty much like going with a very, like a minimalistic fairing. Like a lowrider S fairing. I mean, in terms of the height, obviously there's on the sides and my uh, lower body, there's more, way more uh, protection from the fairing itself. But my face, my helmet area, let's say from my throat up, there's absolutely no wind protection and, and that's pretty much what I thought. It's what I expected. You can't expect uh, to get any wind protection with a, such a short uh, windscreen. As you can hear, I can still hear the music. I'm at 70. Thing is, I feel a lot of wind blowing on my chest and that, that brings in wind, wind noise. But as for the stereo, the stereo is simply so strong, so strong. So you can hear the music. It's not as clear as I'd like it to be because of, you know, again, the noise. The wind, uh, the wind coming in, the noise of the wind mixed with the sound of the music. Not as clear as, of course, with a taller windshield, but still usable. Let's put it that way in terms of music. I think that's thanks to the this powerful Rock uh, Rockford Fosgate system. See, the music is powerful. Music is powerful. It's just the wind. That's it, guys. Go. We're heading home. Woo! Getting fresh, huh? You don't pass me, baby. I'm your daddy. You respect me. 
as I've suspected and thought this windscreen this windshield is minimalistic doesn't doesn't offer much wind protection on high during high speeds but that's not the function of this uh, of this windscreen this windscreen if you ask me was designed in uh, West Coast style for stunt riders you know stunt style with uh, the looks the looks in mind and it really looks badass really looks pretty really looks cool let's put it that way and uh, for that it serves its purpose it's really nice really good looking badass windscreen Harley part and uh, that's what it that's what it is uh, made for that's what it's made for it's supposed to look cool and you know give you some some wind protection some wind protection and that's what it definitely does Sean did you enjoy your ride yeah very good learning experience yeah absolutely next time we'll hit uh, the faster roads yeah. uh, with me because I went only by myself so can you get the helmet off yeah I know how to do it I okay <laughs> so that's it guys this is the windscreen this is uh, what it looks like I think it looks really cool really really cool and it does offer somewhat a uh, little bit more wind protection than if you were without of obviously a windscreen but for touring long touring proper wind protection uh, this is not this is not the windscreen for you nor was it uh, designed for it so it was the designed to be really cool really nice to serve the style you know like I said of the uh, West Coast style and definitely that's it um pretty much and one last thing it's pretty much the last few days of the you know the raffle I need to give this bike away already new designs new colors this is a heather blue I got American flag and color I also got the, the one the single color the white only colored American flag get some of these on my website or the merch or whatever and get into the raffle all uh, I wanted to say so uh, apologies I was planning on getting to Americade and uh, Laconia I don't think it's gonna pan out because I'm, we're moving so I can't really make it I'm busy and bu being busy is good so I'm Sandy that's Sean you're watching holy shift till the next video guys peace out right.